Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry for my makeup look, my hair, and my outfit. I'm just a little bit lazy. Um, so, yeah. We have my first update for Project Polish. I think it's called. I do not remember. Um, this is a Fantastic Ladies collab. Um, yeah. So, okay, let's just start with the t-shirt. This is actually a homemade um, pajama t-shirt. This is just a plain white t-shirt from H&M, which my baby brothers uh, drew on a few years back. And yeah, so I think they are cute. It's fun. They are colorful. And yeah, my makeup today just uh, to address it, I used my two new face palettes from Natasha Denona and I also used soft glam on my eyes today, mostly, um, and I went a little bit ham, so that's about it. But let's get into the project. So. I had in one, two, three, four, five, six nail pol nail polishes uh, when I started this. I am rolling out three, and I'm rolling in six. So yeah, let's jump right in. So the two I'm gonna keep in is first from OPI. Um, as you can see, I have got some use out of it. This is just a topper. Let's see if the camera will focus. Uh, but I would say I'm just above OPI, uh, where it says OPI. So yeah, this is gorgeous, I love it, but I don't use it every single time. And the second one is also from OPI and it's the on pinks and needles. Again, it's a top coat and I'm in the middle of the word OPI. I do wear it on my little finger and my point finger. Both of my hands. Um, so yeah. The other two I also had in are just my top coat and base coat. So those will just stay in until they are done. For the three I'm rolling out now, I have one top coat from Essie and it's the A Cut Above. It's just a pink glitter. I did get a good use out of this, but this one is the oldest nail polish in my collection. And it's not fun to remove at all um so yeah i'm gonna remove or declutter this actually i am not gonna keep this in my collection anymore i'm kind of over it it's not working with my pink polishes and probably not the rest of my polish collection so this will get the chop then the other two are two minis from OPI. I have this really light one. This is now down to here. It was quite full when I brought it in, but it's starting to get super gloopy and I can barely get a nail done without going in three times. And this one I'm down to right here and this is even more gloopy. Than the lighter one. So I'm calling these two done and these will just go in my monthly makeup empties actually because I did get good use out of those. Now for the six polishes I'm rolling in, all of them are from OPI. Three are uh, minis so I will start with those. I have another like shiny top coat kind of 
polish. This one is more purple and blue. Then I have again a lighter one. This is more cool tone than the one I just uh, finished. And this one is about to the dots between OPI. So that's our start on that one. And the other one is again a little bit darker and again more cool toned. And this is basically on top of the name OPI. So that's those. Did I say I was bringing in six? I meant I was bringing in five. Just five. Then the other two are two big ones from OPI. The first one is Bubble Bath. This is just a skin toned color. I'm wearing it today underneath everything else. Um, but this I really like to use after I have done my base coat before I do any other color just to get my nails in one color first. So that's how I'm using that one. Then the other one is this, what's it called? Princess, Princess's Rules. And this is the glittery top coat thingy I'm wearing today. And it's just right above the name OPI. And I would actually love to get this down to this line here. So, yeah, that's my goal with this one. So, I think that will be a nice goal for next update. I do think I can do it because I do usually wear them uh, on all five fingers. I have done it today. You can barely see it on these ones, but up close you can definitely see it. And what else? What else do I want to set a goal on? I would like to have used up half of the lightest one. And then, yeah, maybe half of the darker one. So, yeah, there we have it. I'm still hung up on the pinks. Uh, because that matches my focus shadows mostly um but we will see when we change it up i do have quite a few pinks and purples in my collection and quite a few red orange yellowy kind of shade also so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in my next one bye